Hey y'all, welcome back. Today we're making a floral tombstone cookie for Halloween. I'm starting with a cookie that's been flooded just on the part that's going to be the head of the tombstone. Then I'm using some thick consistency royal icing to pipe a big thick flower. I've turned my petal tip upside down so that I get these really puffy thick petals. I'm using the thicker side of the petal tip facing out away from me and the thinner side facing in. That's what's making these really big puffy cartoon like petals. Next I'm taking some thick pale green icing and making some vine like leaves on either side of the gravestone. I'm just squeezing and pulling back to make a teardrop shape and alternating the angles of those leaves. I'm going to do that on a couple places on the cookie. You can get creative with this and do it wherever you like. I like to do it on the parts that are kind of facing out so that it looks like a floral spray. Excuse the food coloring on my hands, y'all. Add some dots to the center of your flowers. I like to do dots in odd numbers just like petals on a flower. I think it looks more natural. Then I'm taking some darker green, thick consistency icing and making some leaves by taking a tipless piping bag that's been cut into a V shape at the bottom with the V facing away from the bag, so at the tip of the bag, and that makes that pretty leaf shape. I just kind of put those wherever there's a blank space. Next, I'm adding the writing, the RIP, with white food coloring. a darker color on this gravestone. I could have started with a light gray, but I wanted to have that weathered old look. It's Halloween, so we have to make it look nice and spooky. So I'm going over that with that same brush that I used for the white icing before, and that's going to kind of make it look like that crackled, aged stone. It would have been cute to do like a crackle effect on this. I've seen a lot of cookie decorators doing that with um, painting their icing over their raw cookie as they bake it. I think that looks really cute. So that would be a good opportunity to do something creative on this one if you want to try that out. Thanks for watching. I hope y'all like this cookie. Um, if you want to see the full set of Day of the Dead Halloween cookies, you can check them out in my new online class. I have those at sarahgracecookiecompany.com. Be sure to subscribe. I post new videos every Tuesday. Thanks so much. Have a great day. Bye.